That's right. We are looking for uh, Betts, Bryant, and Jacob de Grobs. We did a filler for this box break a little earlier, and congratulations those of you who wanted the filler right here. There's a separate video of that filler, and that gives us our entire odor list for our break. So we're going to do that right now. We're going to find out who gets what team in 2014. Bobin Jumbo. Let's see what happens. Here we go seven times through. We're going to random the owner names seven times. Then we're going to come back and random the teams and stack the lists up side by side. And that's how you get your team of the break. So here we go. Lucky number seven. The first list is finished going through here. And so very, I'm very excited. And I hope I can pull you something big. That's what I want to do. I want to pull you something really nice in this box break. All right, it's time for the big team random. Seven times through for the teams. Lucky number seven. And we stack the lists up side by side. And now you can see your team in the break. Red Sox for Matt D. Cubs for Matt G. And New York Mets belong to Stephen J. I'm going to get this in alphabetical order by team name. And let's get to the box break. Good luck, everybody. Even if you didn't hit one of the big teams, you can still pull some great things out of here. There are three autos coming out in the box break. Uh, and who knows what we'll find in this treasure box happening right now. Seattle and Arizona are for sale. <laughs> Ava Malabella is not kidding either. He, uh, he or she, Ava Malabella. I don't know if it's male, if you're a male or a female, but it doesn't matter much. Um, but this person just does put stuff up for sale and sells teams uh, out of our breaks. Sometimes it, I've seen it happen. So anyway, that is fine. As long as uh, you know, all parties involved are taken care of and ample amount of time, we'll certainly give an extra second or two for anyone who wants to consider their their opportunity. Yeah, that's right. Hustling and bustling. We got a bunch of wheelers and dealers around here so we may as well be wheeling and dealing but uh right now i don't think anybody's gonna gonna bite and uh certainly if you're mulling over selling your team or buying the seattle or arizona you could tell me to wait and i will certainly do that but it looks like it's just time to break. So that's what I'm going to do. Let's do it. Let's hit something big. We got three autographs coming. We're looking for Mookie Betts's. There's a nice Derek Jeter. That's a good rookie card to get your hands on too. Not bad. I mean, Hunter Renfro, he's a well-known one. Appel is another one for the Astros. So. There's some, there's some good things that could come out in 2014. This looks like a hit. It is. Uh, number to 500. And so Texas Rangers against the first 
little something out of the box break here. Texas. I want to be really careful here. There's a nice Abreu. That's another one uh, that I didn't really mention. His, his cards have great appeal and some of them can be very valuable. So maybe we'll hit a big, big Jose Abreu. Uh, so good luck with the White Sox, Frank. This is a that's a Brayu rookie. That's his rookie right there. It's a very exciting box break. We got a nice Roy Halliday, Phillies. Number two, 150, 146 of 150, Roy Halliday. Hope. That's Anthony T pulling that one down. Let's do this, Matt. Where's this big bet set? Where's it? We haven't hit a single auto yet. That's a decent one to get uh, Underwood, right? I think he's a pretty good Cubs one to get, but certainly not the big one. Let's do this thing. I hope we can hit big. Let's do this. Yeah, you did, Brandon. Let me see what the problem is. Hang on one second. Yeah, I know you got in. Let me check it out here. Might have made an error, Brandon. I'm very sorry. I must have made an error because I know you got in. Hmm. Let me see what the problem is. Oh boy, I think I might have made a big mistake. I did, I made a big mistake here. I don't have nearly the right owners in the break that are supposed to be in the break. Let me see what I can do. Let me see. Yeah, really messed this one up. So I'm trying to figure out what I'm gonna. I mean, I can't. I can't do anything other than just move forward with the break. Even though some people got in, some people didn't. 
I uh, accidentally had the filler. And I used the filler for the uh, for the names of the owner list. So I'll explain that my mistake right now to everybody. And then we'll figure out what to do later. I guess I'll have to refund everybody that's not that didn't get in the break. A lot of people got into the break that were supposed to be in the break. But a lot of people didn't get in the break that were supposed to be in the break. So I made a mistake. I'm going to be sending some refunds. Here's what happened. And I do apologize. This has not happened. Uh, this is something that doesn't, doesn't happen. But what I did was I took the uh, all the names from the filler and thought that was the owner name list. And so the owner's name list was actually right here. And so this is th these are the folks that should have been in. These are the folks that ended up being in. So I'm going to figure out from this list, like I, I can see Nathan's going to get a five refunds. Five of them. Yeah, I messed up. I messed up the break. So I'm, tr I'm trying to figure out the only thing I can do is just take what people made it in. Like Frank paid for his spot and had a spot there he got in the filler. So Frank's actually got two spots. So I don't have to refund Frank. And Matt, so some people are going to get refunds. Some people aren't. Uh, Mark, you paid for one spot. That's what you actually got is one spot. So some people, it's okay. Yeah. So, I mean, it worked out fine for you, Mark. You have one spot in the break. But Brandon, Nathan, uh, looks like Joe. I'm going to be sending you a refund. Asa. Asa actually ended up in the break even though I made the mistake. So to me, it looks like 50% 50, 50 of the people got in that uh, should have been in. 50% of the people got in by my mistake. So uh, I have to just apologize, and there's nothing I can do other than just move forward with the box break. Uh, and give those of you who should have got in a refund and say, hey, I'm sorry, man, I, I'm going to give you your money back. And I feel like an idiot. <laughs> it's not something that uh, has happened in, in the past. It's not something that will happen again probably for another few years. But it's just a human error, so I'm trying, trying not to feel too bad about it. And people make mistakes. I made a mistake. So I'm not going to kick myself around too bad about it, but... I do feel very bad. I want to apologize again. And uh, like I said, um, you know, Brandon, I'm really sorry. Brandon pointed out to me. He was like, I don't see my name. And you're right, Brandon. Your name didn't get into the break like it should have been. So I'm going to give you a refund. I'm going to give everybody a refund as soon as the break is over. Um, a few people, though, are unaffected. Mark's unaffected. Frank's unaffected. He's got two, his two spots. So we're just going to do do right by the people who've gotten their team. It's not like I can say, hey, we, we're going to redo the random. We can't do that. These guys have gotten it. Matt's got the Cubs. That's Matt bought into the break. He's got the Cubs. I can't do anything different. Uh, Frank bought into the break. He got the Yankees. I'm not going to tell Frank, oh, we're going to re-random. That just would not be right. Cannot do that. So uh, we're just going to move forward. And um, I will be sending refunds after the break. My sincerest apologies. And hopefully, uh, hopefully that never happens again.
You think everybody should get 100 Mickey Mantles? <laughs> okay. All right, Mark. <laughs> Good luck. Oh, gosh. Well, maybe this is the big Mookie Betts break. Would that be something for, for Matt D to have, a, you know, $5,000 Mookie Betts come out? Good luck, Matt D. And anyone in the break, I hope you hit big. I, I still want to see somebody hit big. And uh, it can certainly happen. We could pull a big Chris Bryant. There's an Appel. Appel was so big. There's a nice Mookie Betts rookie. And he's got a flag in the background. So that's great. This is a very cool rookie card of Mookie Betts. That is solid. Got the flag in the background. Uh, here's a Jake Barrett autograph. That's our first autograph out of the box break. And this is 55 of 99. So very nice. Arizona Diamondbacks hit for Jason Y. Way to go, Jason Y. There's a really nice Jacob deGrom. And Mookie Betts base rookie card. Profar. Franklin Barreto. Good luck, everybody, in the box break. Hope you had something terrific. We're looking for the Mookie Betts, the Chris Bryants. Tyler Wade for the Yankees would be a pretty good one to get coming out. Uh, Frank, If since you have the Yankees, that's a nice CC Sabathia. Number to 500. Way to go. It's Jose Abreu, rookie. Nice Franco, Phillies, Franco. We do have another 2014 Bowman box break uh, that's going to be available. So if you want to get in this, it's a great box break to get into. You can hit really big. We're at, we've actually been going through a case of this. And uh, so it's really exciting. It's one of the most exciting breaks we have around here, if you ask me. Because uh, we could hit a $10,000 Mookie Betts or just something crazy good. And I will be listing the next one of these very soon. Right after the break is over. 
Here's a nice Grinky. Got a flag in the background. Those are a little more rare. And then our second autograph comes out. Billy Burns for the Washington Nationals. Under congratulations. So we've had two autos. Uh, Washington Nationals autograph. And what was the other one? I can't remember right now. So let's see. What was the other one? Right here. Okay, Arizona, Jake Barrett. So we've had Jason hit nice here and Nationals owner, congratulations. I'm going to get this in alphabetical order too. Okay, it is. So Washington Nationals. Who has the Nationals? There it is. Asa hit with the Nationals auto just now, the Billy Burns. Congratulations. To you, my friend. So we've not seen a Chris Bryant. We've had um, a Mookie Betts base. Here's a nice Freddie Freeman for the Atlanta Braves. Owner. That's awesome. David W. Max Freed. Maybe we're just got a big hit right around the corner here. Good luck in the break. Let's pull down a monster, Chris Bryant or Mookie Betts. Hope. That's right, we've been going through a case of 2014 Bowman box by box and looking for some of the biggest hits we can find around here. And our next autograph is a Toronto Blue Jays. So congratulations to the Blue Jays owner. Nice hit in the box break. That is Blue Jays. And there's so many combo teams in here. This might go. Okay, there we go. David W. Uh, pulls down a Toronto autograph. So that is good stuff. David W. Congratulations, my friend. It's not too late. We can still pull a really monster hit out of here in this box break. Then we could pull a huge Mookie Betts or Chris Bryant. Rookie. What do we got? Green. Chase Anderson. Arizona. Green. Number to 75. 
Chase Anderson there for Jason. This is going to be a really nice hit. Look at this. That's a really great hit. Uh, that's terrific. Miami Marlins owner picking up one right there. Nice one, Asa. Trey Ball. There's a Chris Bryant Chrome. All right. Yes, Chris Bryant Chrome. A little something something for the Cubs owner. Good luck, everybody, in the final pack in the box break in 2014 Bowman. And that's a pretty good one there. Chris Bryant, base rookie. And that's our box break, everybody, in 2014 Bowman. And I'm sure a lot of you are noticing or have noticed that a lot of the names don't fit. And so, I yes, I just want to recap. I did make a big mistake when I put this box break together with the names. Ended up including the filler names when I should have included the owner names into the break. So I want to apologize again for that. I'm going to start sending a few refunds out. Uh, it looks like around 50% of the people uh, got in that were supposed to get in, but 50%, around 50% uh, didn't get in. So I'm going to start sending those refunds right now with my sincerest apologies. Like I said, that never happens around here. So I do apologize again for that. <laughs> 